Welcome back, Jeff Frick here at HP Discover 2013. Uh, we're here with Greg Guti, product manager from MZI Healthcare, and Greg's here to tell us a little bit about some of how you're using some of the HP software to change your business. So first off, tell us a little bit about the uh, MZI software. <laughs> sure, um, MZI Healthcare has been on the payer side for over 25 years, really delivering software solutions to help manage patients in, a, in an insurance industry. Okay. Um, what we wanted to do is really expand our business more into the hospital and provider market. Okay. And we started to look around for how we could deliver point of care solutions, uh, specifically around analytics. And to do that, we needed a, a strong infrastructure, and so that's what brought us to HP Vertic. So what does that mean, uh, point of care solution? What, what are the types of, of capabilities that you're trying to deliver the software? Sure, well we do a lot of different things. We're looking for um, predictive modeling on patients, look at where risk lies. Okay. Um, a good example is, you know, personal example was my aunt um, last year had uh, ended up in the hospital and uh, had produced uh, based on different medications she was taking from a multitude of different specialties for her chronic disease um, into a coma. That's and it was, a, yeah, that. it was a, a very, you know, um, situation that really didn't need to happen, I guess, is the, is the point. And it was based around data. If the physicians at the point of care would have been able to see that type of information when they actually met with the patient, they could have understood what type of medications might have contraindicated with her um, and prevented that whole thing. And that's what our software is really about. It's about okay. getting information to the right people at the right time at the point of care. So when the doctor is actually seeing the patient, they get the critical information they need from multiple different systems that that patient's information's in. Okay, and that's a, that's the new application that you built and you use Vertica to use it. We or, do. Excuse me to build it. Yes. Okay. Our platform runs on Vertica, and one of the key things that really led us to Vertica was really the speed. Um, and I think that that makes uh, such a big difference. Um, for us when we started looking at a platform that really could bring out that information at the speed that we needed to get it to, uh, to those providers. Now is, is speed, in terms of speed of your developing the application, speed of delivering information to the doctors, speed of analytics, would you say speed, what do you mean speed Well, exactly? when, we, when we really looked at, I mean, I guess a little bit of all of those things, but okay. the primary thing when we first started looking for a platform was being able to run some complex queries on data and get that information to return pretty quickly. Okay. What we found with proof of concept with Vertica was that we really got a lot more than that, just that uh, with the platform. One of the competitive advantages I think that we have is um, a lot of our competition have to build cubes around summarized data, and when things change, it, it causes you know there's a lot of IT effort to do that. Right. Um, and and many of our clients have said you know hey we have this solution it takes us a day to three days to load our data and get it in there so people can start looking at where there might be problems. And with Vertica we can load that relatively quickly. Um, you know some of our, our claim data is loading at around two million claims a minute. So it's just fast um, loading, and it's the minute that starts loading, it's available for analytic work right away. Okay, so talk a little bit about the use cases, and, and it sounds like the doctors, right, who would have been able to help your aunt not get in this situation. They're obviously not big data scientists, right? They're smart guys, they went to a lot of school, uh, we trust them with our care, but they're not data scientists. So are they the ones that are actually using this tool? Yeah, so the, uh, our tool is really based for the end user to be, make it easy for them to get information without having to have a lot of IT. If you look at a provider's office, they may not even have anyone in the office that knows truly IT work. Um, and so we wanted to provide them with a platform that was very uh, click and point and get information um, without having to learn any of the IT infrastructure around that. And so is the use case that they do this as part of their pre, you know, you've got someone's coming in for an appointment, is kind of their pre-work to do some analysis, or what's kind of the real use case? Because you said some of the competitive stuff takes days to load. Yeah. Clearly, that's not uh, part of the solution. Yeah, I think, you know, things are changing really rapidly in healthcare, okay. and um, you, you can see that, um, you know, the, the transition right now to getting that data all into one area so that a provider can see all aspects of a patient's continuum of care is very critical. Um, and a lot of the information in, in the past has been coming from the payer market, and that information is based on claims, which sometimes take anywhere from 30 days to 60 days, really get into a system where someone can even look at it, right. which is way too late for a patient. Right. Right. What we're doing is actually pulling information from chart information, lab information, loading that live into the system, and when a person checks in either to a hospital or into um, you know, the, the, their family care practitioner, that information for maybe gaps in care, things that they might need based on their chronic illnesses 
for um, admissions and discharge from the hospital. All that information is available for the provider to make really data-driven driven decisions at that point. Is it a big integration project to pull all the disparate data types, or is that part of what your other core software product does? No, it, you know, right now, really, in healthcare, data acquisition is probably the biggest challenge that's out there. Okay. Um, and, and by no means um, is it an easy task to do, um, but as healthcare progresses, things are becoming easier, there's more standards out there, right. and we're able to get that information in pretty easily. And of course, all the regulatory, all the regulatory uh, hurdles that you have to cross. So, Absolutely. just one last point. You talked about, about the company's 25 years old, uh, and you guys have been basically doing the same thing with minor changes for all these years. Talk about how you, know, you embraced an opportunity to kind of go a new direction and open up a new market for your company, and how these tools enabled you to do that successfully. Absolutely. Well, we wanted to really look at maybe not be in the bleeding edge of technology, but really be on the cutting edge of technology. Okay. And a lot of our customers, um, both small and large, uh, really needed a platform that they could analyze this data in, but they really, in a lot of cases, couldn't afford to purchase that their, themselves. And so the price point on the Vertica system allowed us to, to install a, a big data solution and spread that cost over all of our clients through um, cloud applications. Yeah. and really give that those folks that um, the same capability that larger institutions may have had in the past. Right. Um, and so that's really helped us out as a business because it's expanded our business from the payer market now into hospitals and providers. Um, when we first started, we were looking at uh, potentially having you know, a whole team of data folks to manage this da data warehouse on the cloud. Um, and with the Vertica system, we really uh, only hired one full FTE for that that management of that data. So our, our costs as a company uh, were greatly reduced on it right. with the Vertica system. So you got two of the big three. You got cloud and you have big data. So Absolutely. terrific. So again, Greg Goody, product manager, MZI Healthcare. Thanks for coming on. It's great. You know, we talk a lot about cloud and we talk a lot about big data, but it's fun to actually talk to somebody that's implementing it in the field with, uh, with real people solving real problems. Thanks for coming on. Thank you. Jeff Frick signing off from HP Discover 2013. We'll be right back.